He was only 12 when polio left his hands deformed and his right leg partially affected. Although the deadly disease made the life of young Axel Salise difficult, his disability never broke his spirit. The quiet barangay of Bailao in Mambaho, Comigin is a witness to this exceptional resilience. Cause he ain't heavy He's my brother It's a long, long road Coming from a broken family, Axel had to fiend for himself despite his disability. He kept his head held high and turned obstacles into opportunities, looking at every trial as a challenge. Ang halin, iuli sa farmers, ang ginansya mo'y ako. This innate sense of entrepreneurship would stay with Axel long after years in college. Life as an employee, however, only made him realize that he wanted to do more. Sa sige na ako panarbaho, nakita na ako nga, wala, di ha ang gigkataman. Maayaw ang mga posisyon, okay rapod ang sweldo, pero mas patsada siya kung ikaw ang amo. Ikaw ang magpadagan sa negosyo. That time, sige ko pangita kung saan ako, asa ko magkapangita ang puhunan. Kaya lisugi kay ang puhunan, labi na sa tsa mong case. In 2012, as Axel was elected president of the Persons with Exceptional Reserve Skills Association, or PRERSA, little did he know that his life was about to take a different direction. One time, nakabasa ko ang newspaper. Nakita na ako nga, nag-launch ang DOLE, muna nga mga program. Ang to nakita na ako nga na mga livelihood ay So kita na ako kung asa ko nga mo fit Ang dole na pasalamat ko nga Gibakapan gigo Tabangan nga ma-realize nga makapagawas gid ang proposal Para nga mo come up mi sa usaka proyekto Nga muna nigawas na ako ang akong i-apply ang face on it Axel was more than determined to avail the dole integrated livelihood and emergency employment program and in 2014, through the Bureau of Workers with Special Concerns, Dole 10 granted him 10,000 pesos for a Pisonet unit, an arcade-style computer used as internet or gaming vending machine. Maglisod ko kumpit sa akong mga silingan na doon ay mga kompeteran, tungod kayo nakapanukad sila, daghan sila unit. So ako is isa lang. So ang gihimo na ako is, ang akong profession is gigamit na ako once nga mudawat ko nga encoding, inay nga mambak na sa printer. Prof. Fred, gina-edit na nako na. Correct na nako ang grammar. Ginapatsada na ako. Walay additional nga bayad. Axel's excellent customer service won him loyal customers and attracted more patrons. He also teamed up with his wife, who has a background in hotel and restaurant management, in creating digital designs and layouts for event decorations, tarps, giveaways, and invitations. He further maximized one single piece of that unit by accepting research works. As his income steadily rose, Axel decided to expand with the purchase of 10 second-hand computer units and rent a space at the Mambaho Public Market. Thus, Axel Service's Internet Cafe came to be. This was going to be the beginning of a more extensive list of new services, from computer troubleshooting, program installation, maintenance, and cleaning, to wireless security system services, from heat press printing to the retailing of computer accessories. With the considerable growth of Axel's business, it was time to bring in additional manpower. Gikuha na ko kung mga pagumang ko, may amoy ni assess na ko, so mas napalapad na mo ang among income, kitulo na mi ang magtrabaho, pero gipa-eskwila na ko sila. Hantod nga, gawas anang duha nga nag-backup na ko ang mga pagumang ko na ko, napay ko yung mga pagumang ko na wala na ko nagpuyo, na kahuman na ang eskwila, nga ni, patsada sa ang ilahang mga posisyon karon na sila sa kagayang di oro na katarbaho na. Among them is Clarence, who finished a computer vocational course at TESDA thanks to Axel. Ako kayo kung pasalamat sa iya, kay kung di tungod niya, wala ko karon believe you ko niya. To this day, 
Axel continues to help his fellow PWDs. Jofel Aguirre, who once trained under him, recounts Axel's kindness. Dito ko nag OJT sa ila Sir Axel. And tungod sa kaayo po ni Sir Axel, siya gid mismo ang nagdevelop sa akong Kaibalos computer. Siya gid mismo ang nag-enhance ako sa mga paagi, sa mga technique para mas mamaayo pa gyud ang akong paggamit sa computer. Igsuon gyud ang iyang pagtagad namo. Bukas kayo ang iyang kasing-kasing pagtabang namo. Today, Jofel works as a data encoder at the local government unit of Mahinok. Through his leadership as Puerza president, Axel lobbied for the release of 250,000 pesos in Dole 10 assistance, benefiting 24 PWDs and some senior citizens in October 2017. 24 sewing machines were made available for a saco bag and rag making project. Paningkamot ng kita, ang gobyerno daghan kayo og programa para sa katauhan. Pangalagaan nato dayon ang programa sa gobyerno, ang trust sa gobyerno ang gihatag nato. Kay dili na ko maabot ni ang naa na ko karon kung wala ang gobyerno. Ang Dole is Department of Labor and Employment, di ba? Pero sa ako Dole is Department of Living Enhancement, Life Enrichment. He is my brother. He ain't heavy He's my brother Axel's story is a testament that we can all rise above difficulties in life and be an inspiration to others To Axel, Dole commends you and may you continue to do more and be more Cause he ain't heavy He's my brother It's a long, long